Which pendulum is best for someone who is just starting with pendulum healing? I asked this question to experts and some experienced users in pendulum healing and I received some interesting answers which I would like to share with you in this video. Hello, I'm Serviusz and in my channel I share with you my experiences and discoveries as well as practical tips, tools and techniques how to improve your life. So if you are new to my channel, please consider subscribing to watch more videos about practical techniques which you can use to improve your life right now. For dowsing, any pendulum is good enough. But for pendulum healing, you need to have a so-called shape emitter, a pendulum which emits specific radiation, which helps sending commands into the matrix. So it's usually a pendulum which radiates a white radiostatic color or maybe negative green radiostatic color. The best way to test if the pendulum is right for you is just to take it in your hands, spin it over your hand and feel the energy. Do you like it? Does it feel harsh or it feels soft and nice and gentle? To do this, you probably need to go to a, um, some spiritual shop or maybe some spiritual exhibition uh, in your area because you can't really do it uh, when you purchase something online. I've noticed that we are attracted to some pendulums because probably the energy they emit is needed by us uh, on this, uh, at this time in our life. Sometimes I even wonder, is it me who is uh, choosing the pendulum or perhaps the pendulum is choosing me as a conduit for its energy to manifest in, on this earth plane? Experienced pendulum healers, they always have more than one pendulum. So as you progress your uh, pendulum healing journey, you probably would like to buy one or two more pendulums. But of course, you need to start with something. So that's why in this video, I'm trying to answer the question, which pendulum is best for a beginner? You need to know that there is no one pendulum which is best for everything. There are pendulums which specializes in, uh, let's say, killing bacteria or the other energizing people. So if you are using one to do the other, you won't have the same results. But of course, generally, you can probably find some pendulums which are most useful for the most applications and you can at least start using them in pendulum healing. To have only one pendulum, you need to understand that having only one tool has got uh, that every tool has got its limitations. So, you know, this pendulum may be good for one thing, but it may be not so good for others. So you cannot expect the same good results as you were using a um, pendulum which is designed to do totally different thing. It is important to note that, you know, crystal pendulums, although they are very beautiful and they are good for dowsing, are not really good for pendulum healing because crystals they um, receive information and they can be programmed with information. So when you work with somebody who is sick, the pendulum, crystal pendulum can uh, receive this information and uh, transform and transfer this information to another people or even you when you put it in your pocket. And you don't want to do this. You don't want to transfer somebody else's negative energies uh, into your energy field or transfer them uh, to another patient. Another important information is that uh, pendulums with chain, they don't give you as good uh, energetic protections as pendulums using a uh, black cord. By the way, cor cord in your pendulum should always be black. It shouldn't be any kind of other fancy color because the black color is the best to transfer all the uh, radiostatic uh, energies you want to work with. And uh, the other good things about um, having a pendulum with a um, cord is that it's probably easier to replace when it warms out, uh, comparing to the pendulum with the chain. So here are some names people mention they recommend for a beginner in pendulum healing. First was uh, Isis pendulum, very popular, affordable and um, quite um, good for um, many healing applications. The other is uh, Orion, very powerful uh, pendulum. The other is Hunter Healer. And there is also another pendulum uh, coming soon on the market. We, we had a glance of um, the, this uh, pendulum uh, from Dr. Eric Hunter. This is his new design. And um, perhaps this one will be the best pendulum for you. So is there really a one pendulum which does it all for you? 
Perhaps it is. It is the pendulum you choose f uh, as a first one to start your pendulum journey. Choose the pendulum which you resonate best uh, with and um, start using it um, to improve your life. And as you progress in your journey, as you learn more skills, more ex gain you more experience, perhaps then you will know which pendulum you need to buy next, which will allow you to do something which you are not able to do with your uh, first pendulum. So if you want my opinion, which pendulum I would recommend uh, for you at this moment, I can tell that I have experience with Isis pendulum and it's very good positive experience. And this pendulum is uh, very easy to use. Uh, you can put it in your pocket and it's very affordable in price. If you want to learn more about it, please have a look at the video here where I explain more information about this amazing pendulum. So if you like this video, please give it a thumb up, share it with your friends and consider subscribing to my channel if you want to watch more videos about practical techniques which can improve your life. Thank you for watching.